I was actually on that video. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, um, I'm a historian, and of course I led the effort to preserve Enview Plantation and Lee Hall Mansion sometime last century. And, uh, <laughs> I do want to say that I hope uh, that we have some type of citizens com uh, committee <coughs> that works with every developer, or actually even before the developer comes in, to help ensure that we preserve not only the historical legacy that exists up in the Lee Hall area, but also pres preservation of green space, and also enhance our heritage tourism. There's no doubt that our historic resources here in Newport News are fantastic. They're uh, not supported act, actually with enough uh, dollars, which I understand. I worked for the city for 30 years. But I do hope, I guess my question is, will we have an opportunity, the citizens here in Newport News and preservationists throughout the Commonwealth of Virginia, to be able to have a say in framing the type of development and also working with the developers selected to actually uh, create something that meets this golden mean of uh, having preservation and development going hand in hand. Thank you, sir. Pleasure. Well, as long as um, I have, am involved in any process in any venture like that, there will always be citizen input available. I'm not speaking for the city manager, but I think we are on the same page with that. At what point in the process will that be? It, it will be a, a joint effort between the, the whoever the planner selector is, and in some cases even uh, looking at the, uh, the the plans that are presented to us, we may have citizen input at that time as well. But I guarantee you there will be citizen input in any major thing that we do in the city. It is, it is my intention to have that um, as part of the, the uh, plan. I knew you would do that. <laughs> Anything you want to add to that? I'll just bring that. As you probably know, there are currently reserved around the plantation, 25 acres. We've already had a conversation with staff about, is that sufficient? We went out with a request for qualifications. They were doing yesterday, so we will be starting that process. That was a very, very important part in the proposal that we put out there for developers to respond to. Not only just around the plantation, but Lee Hall and trying to keep with the whole sense of that. Yeah, the, the critical thing is the view shed as you drive Absolutely. around and how you look at the house. <coughs> and that will enhance any development around there. Um, last century sometime there was an attempt to develop the area and every time they did that, uh, actually the preservation of those view sheds, the enhancement of the activities that go on at both historic houses, of those historic houses, became a paramount issue. And so I just... That, that's a huge part of the proposal that we put out there. And I said, we only ask the qualifications. We don't have any design or concepts yet because we want to have the process that you described to make sure that the community is involved and know that we'll do it. And of course, it's right there next to Newport News Park, so there's, it's adjacent to that. That'll be critical also, but we think we have a fantastic opportunity to do it right. I know there was some, before my time, there was some development proposed out there. I like to think everything happens for a reason, and so we'd like to do it right. Great.